Good morning or evening or afternoon, wherever you're at. Somewhere. And welcome to Coffinated, the coffee chat show with me and Mr. Newly Dead. Uh, my name is Laura. <laughs> Joel. And we are the Newly Duds. And we're uh, here. Can they see Shaggy? You're just pointing at the ground. <laughs> like down here. Uh, our dog is, dog is at our feet. Uh, today we are talking about a coffee that came from, oh, it's good that you pointed that way because it came from down under. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. It came from our friend in Australia. Yes. Yes. Who did it come from, Joel? So for those of you who are not familiar with the channel, uh, you know that we have a, a uh, across the pond love affair with uh, Raul and Posh Madblood. Across the pond? Of the Madbloods. Yeah. Across <laughs> the ditch. Well, if we were in New Zealand, it'd be across, across the ditch. Across the ditch. Yeah. Oh, is that what they say? Mm -hmm. Across if the ditch. In, if you're New Zealand or in Australia and they're talking about each other, it's across the ditch. But we're across the pond. Um, we're across the world. We're a long ways away. I thought across the pond was like England and stuff. It is. Yeah. 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 We're on the other side of the continent or the, uh, the world. Not continent. <laughs> anyway. We're on the other side of the world. We have gone off the rails. We are. Well. Uh, so <laughs> Posh and Raul are, are out of Australia and I have done some shows with Raul and we've been a fan of theirs. They've been a fan of ours. We've done a show with them together um, and we've talked about swapping some things. So they have sent us one of their favorite coffees from Australia and uh, a little insider information. There may be something going back at some point soon. But uh, in the meantime, if you've not checked them out, go to their YouTube channel. I'll put the information up here. Mm -hmm. um, and Raul is very consistent with his output. Apparently Shaggy wants to be seen now. Uh, with his output as far as the content that they create. So just go check it out. It's all good. And uh, we're fans. Yeah. So thank you very much for sending this. I know that, uh, you know, shipping things can sometimes be a little costly. You know, especially if you're across the pond. Down under. <laughs> Down oh, under. Shaggy, you were yes. Um. First of all, I think this this smells delightful. So uh, it's called the darkness, a uh, terror from beyond space. So you know it's got skulls on it. That's like right up our alley. So not to be um, affiliated with Justin uh, from the darkness. Right. Yeah. As soon Justin as I saw office. it, I started singing that. You know, I believe in a thing called love song or whatever. Which check out his YouTube channel. <laughs> uh, it's a resealable uh, Ziploc bag, which is always a, a nice thing because it keeps your coffee fresh. Um, it looks like it was uh, roasted maybe in January. So that's nice. So it's it's pretty fresh. Fresh. Um, I, I'm going to read the back of it. So it says, people of Earth, the darkness has arrived. I feel like I'm reading one of our dollar store uh, drive-in, uh, you know, synopsis. <laughs> it does. Um, for the robots, aliens, creatures of the night, and everything that lurks in the shadows, be restored with the monstrous flavors of vanilla, almond, and dark chocolate. Uh, it says that the roast degree is uh, all the way up. Uh, the acidity is pretty much all the way down. The flavors are vanilla, almond, and dark chocolate, and the aroma is walnut and cocoa. Uh, it says roasted, blended, and packed in Australia from imported coffee beans. Uh, Cafe du Kale, I'm probably pronouncing all this stuff wrong. And it says it's, uh, they're located in Coburg, North Victoria. So this so, is truly an Australian coffee, not yeah. just something that they got there and sent. It's actually an Australian yeah, they do have a so. QR code on here. Oh, there's a, a little shout out to the artwork on here. Uh, the artist is uh, Half Price Hancock. So shout out to you, Half Price. Uh, I like your name. Um, so you can check out their their information. Um, there is a, like I said, a, a QR code on here. Um, so you can uh, check them out. Um, looks like it's DC. Uh, specialty coffee roasters is is who did it. I'll put something up here for you. Yes, please. Thank you. Um, yeah. So should we should we get into the coffee? We should. All right. Work. It's cold. Yes. Um, I've got my my coffee mug here. So we've got I've got a ghosty today. What do you've got? You've got Svengoolie. Do you want to explain who Svengoolie is once you're done drinking your coffee? 
Well, I used it because we met because of our love of, of horror hosts. So we I figured, did. what yeah. better way? We got to do clink to before share. you drink, though, Joel. No, we're, we're, we're awfully far away from each other. Clink before you drink. You ready? All right. Smells good. I'm not getting the uh, the notes, though. I mean, it smells like coffee. And walnut and cocoa is supposed to be the aroma. I don't I mean, know what walnuts smell like. Walls? <laughs> the walls? Mm -hmm. I mean, it smells nutty, I guess. Well, I'm not getting chocolate, as far as the smell is concerned. Hmm. On the package that it came in, it said on there that it, that they were shipping coffee. And I found that amusing. I don't know why. It is a darker roast, but you know, if you've watched this program at all, I'm not a huge fan of dark roasts, but I yeah. don't mind this. Vanilla, almond, and dark chocolate. It's probably because it's not super acidic, and I don't really like like super acidic kind of things either. I don't think. Um, it, it, I, I do taste. It, it is dark. Though. It, it is, you taste it the doesn't, darkness? It didn't look dark and it didn't. Do you taste the darkness, Joel? It didn't, it didn't uh, look that way when we were brewing it and it didn't smell that way, but. It tastes like it, though. It's definitely deep. Yeah. It does have some, like, deep, yeah, deeper aromas. Let me Earthy. see. Yeah. <laughs> I, did, I did cleanse the palate. I haven't eaten anything. I just drank some water this morning. I, yeah, there's, there's nothing, nothing on my palate this morning, so. Um, I yeah. mean, I can kind of like, like a darker chocolate kind of flavor. No. Yeah. Like I said, it's, it's definitely got an earthy, um, taste. Uh, I sometimes wish that like we could just do a blind taste of a coffee and see if we can taste like the, the notes of it. And then just be like, then look at the bag, you know? I mean, we could we could always do that. Yeah, because then Nothing we could be like us. the true test of like what we what of we our think palates. is it. Yeah, which is probably nothing. <laughs> I've burned my taste buds off over the years with hot pizza and concerts and concerts. No, and dirt. I don't know. And what are you doing? Eating dirt. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing in your spare time. Yeah. No, just lots and lots of like scalding hot coffee. That's true. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know that I get the notes, but it's, it's, it's tasty. It's, you know? it's good. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's decent coffee. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I mean, it's nothing to, you know, be mad at or anything like mm -hmm. that. I wonder if this is like a, the litmus test for uh, Australian coffee or if this is like the, like the, you know, the best Folgers. of the best or like the standard or like <laughs> the, but it's definitely not the Folgers. No. But I'd be curious. I'll have to reach out to, to them and find out. Yeah, kind of where it falls in line with their. Because I'm assuming that they sent us kind of like what their favorite is. Not 100 percent sure on that, but are they coffee drinkers? Are you coffee drinkers? Hmm. They drink all kinds of stuff. They yeah. do reviews on drinks and things like we do. Yeah, but but do they drink coffee? As far as I know, I, yeah. I mean, I've seen their their reviews on like their like crazy snacks and stuff. That milk thing that they did the other day was funny. That milk drink, and then the the yeah. <laughs> my favorite part was when they were talking about like powdered whatever like he was like you know talking about was like powdered dust whatever oh, yeah. balls yeah <laughs> that was funny no ball no balls yeah, whatever, it, was yeah. Like, it tastes right. like yeah dust or whatever <laughs> <That's funny. laughs> you, yeah they don't do coffee reviews but they do. that's what i, that's what I, I thought that's why coffee, that's yeah. why i was wondering if they actually drink coffee or if they just oh, knew yeah. that we drank coffee and that's why they sent it to us right i'll find out and i'll a little blurb. Yeah, because we don't want to send them coffee back if that's not something that they're into. Yeah. So there's a lot of good coffee roasters here we want to promote. Right. So, yeah. I, I like it. Oh, what would you yeah. give it? Uh, do we do 10? We do 10 coffee beans, don't we? Mm -hmm. yeah. Everything's 10 except um, when we're talking about movies. True, true, true. I don't know why we did that. Food and drinks are 10. We always, coffee, yeah, we so. always mess ourselves up that way. <sighs> All right. Well, out of 10 zombies. zombies, yeah, what would you give it? Six. I'd like to try some others though, because yeah. I have a feeling that there might be other ones that mm -hmm. that speak to me more. But yep. I'm gonna give it a introductory. yeah. I'm gonna give it a five. You know, because like uh, I think I feel like it's like a solid coffee that I would I would definitely drink again. You know, if uh, if I I mean I'm gonna drink more coffee. You know, say, well we'll finish this bag. bag. Yeah, like you know. She's just not a dark roast kind yep. of person, so yep. that's the only thing I think that's kind of yeah. It's not, uh, it's not hitting all like the, the hot buttons for me. You know, the mouth feels just like average. Mm. 
Uh, Got a nice aroma. I know it's sort a little of bit weird of an aftertaste, here saying but, feel, I, but but that that's a thing. That's a thing, yeah, especially since I've had a couple of like velvety kind of coffees where they've like a, a little difference. oilier. There really is. It's like when people are like, "Beer tastes all the same." I'm like, "No, no, it really mm -hmm. doesn't." If you've had different beer, if you've yeah. just been drinking domestic beer your whole life, right? It's all yeah. It's all the same, and those but. those ones that I've had that have that like slippery feel on the tongue. Yeah, you it's know? definitely got a, a. There's different. Like oilier or whatever. There's just... a very oaky afterbirth, you know. <laughs> yeah. Um. All right. Well. Thank you, Raul and Posh. Yes. Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. And look for thank something you for the love and support coming from this side of the pond. Yeah, the back pond. over there. And uh, if it's not coffee, it'll be it'll be snacks for sure. But we'll 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 chat. Yeah, we'll chat. We'll try to figure out what your favorite thing is because you know we love coffee so but check out the mad bloods on their youtube channel again yeah. i'll put the link up here for you uh tell them that the newly dead sent you and uh share the love and you can find us at the newly uh for all of your spooky needs and uh you know you can find all of the information on there we do a podcast of our dollar store drive-in tv program that is on tangler television um, that is streaming on all sorts of different places. We'll just say that because yeah, uh, a lot it. of times it's on YouTube. Um, a blog. Yeah, we're yeah. also creating art. We're going to be, uh, if you're local here in uh, the Rockford area, we're going to be at Summer Ween uh, at the end of May uh, at Wolf Hollow. So that's going to be a fun, that. dark carnival kind of thing um, that they're going to be having on May 26th, I think is the date. Uh, so please check that out. And um, I guess and until next time, do we have a, an outro for this? I always forget. Stay caffeinated. That's right. Stay caffeinated. Thanks for watching. Bye. We belong 